Okay, what's the percent by mass of sugar in this gum? That's what we're going to try and figure out today. So the first thing we need to do is get the mass of the gum. And I'm going to use the mass or get the mass with the wrapper on because later on I want to put the, I'm going to use the wrapper to put the gum on the scale so I don't mess up the scale and make it gross. First things first, let's get the mass of this gum with the wrapper. Next part is the hard part, chewing the gum. But I'm gonna do it for science. the sweetness is pretty much gone from this gum. Meaning, I've absorbed most of the sugar that I'm going to be able to absorb from this gum. So, whatever mass it lost is going to be the mass of that sugar that I absorbed. But I don't want the water weight of my saliva to throw off the mass amount. So I'm going to try and suck off as much as I can of the saliva. Perfect. So what if we change the sample size? What if I use two pieces, double the mass? Will that change the percent composition, the percent by mass of sugar in the gum? Will it? Let's find out. I'm going to start off with two pieces, do the same exact thing, but just now double the amount. Take a look. 